Hey, 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 YouTube, YouTube, before we hop into this video, make sure you go ahead and go over to my Twitter at StabGuyRanger and hit that follow button real quick. Subscribe to this channel. Hit the like button, man. Smash that like button real quick right now, my nigga, right now. And hit that bell so you get notifications on when I upload and become notification squad. So, hey, let's get it cracking. Woo woo. Yeah, my name G Herbo. I like nasty bitch. I like classy bitch. Look fake sassy bitch. I got ratchet bitch. Bossed up bad bitch. Foreign swag bitch. Alright, my dudes, what's going on? Stair got range, man. Y'all already know what, what's going on, how it's popping, you feel me? We popping off real quick. But look, this is a very important special video because this is one of the most rarest footages I could find, you feel me? This is one of the most deepest, most secretive, most, you know, compassionate videos I could find, you feel me? It's one of the most rarest footages I could find because a lot of people want to make Windows Excel pages and whatnot and put every single archetype in the boxes and whatnot and then put down what badges they got. No, this is a literal, a literal, oh, literal video of the archetypes being shown one by one and shown as a combination of either both archetypes or the archetypes that they've given us the new ones so we are given archetypes 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 on top of archetypes dual archetypes a primary skill and a secondary skill i know i say archetypes a lot but look i'm saying it a lot because there are so many things that they have given us they've given us the choice to have two archetypes and then on top of that we're getting the badges that we need in order to succeed with these players that we're going to build and i'm definitely gonna have best player build videos coming out soon when the game literally drops and on i think it drops the release date is the 19th but the prelude does definitely come out uh ooh, next week i think about next week i don't know but the prelude comes out a couple days before the actual release date so i will be giving you guys player builds during the prelude my bad not during the release you know the real 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 release date of the game i will be giving it out to you guys on the prelude so you guys get ahead of yourself and know which player you guys are trying to create i don't know why i can't talk right now but definitely look into this video so i mean you guys can i honestly could check what you guys want to have right now before the prelude even comes out because with this video again like i said with this rare footage it shows you combinations of the archetypes that you can make and skills that you can put together so me i put this on life my dude i put this on my life the first player that i'm creating is a very op build i see it already the only bad thing about it or not even bad but the only low attributes that it has is uh well first of all let me tell you guys which skills i'm gonna be you know making so the first primary skill that i'm gonna have is shot creator the second one is gonna be passing and dribbling pretty much with this is that Hey, with this, this is going to be an OP archetype build, you feel me? This is going to be one of the most best, and I'm telling you guys straight up off the dome that this is going to be the best archetype you can make, because it's honestly OP. You get three Hall of Fame badges, and you get two gold badges. The Hall of Fame badges you get is Ankle Breaker, my dude. I know that for sure. Ankle Breaker, that's all I need to get to Hall of Fame, my dude. That's all I'm going to be working for and grinding for when I get this archetype, when I get this build together. Shot Creator, again, like I said primary skill is going to be shot creator the second skill is going to be passing and dribbling and i'm going to have a point guard that i can make him at the tallest height i don't know if that will affect that i, I don't know i don't know if this will affect my player i know that they did this in uh 2k17 i'm pretty sure it will affect my player but in 2k17 you guys know that if you got even if you make your guy a certain height or weight it will affect how he may run his speed and whatnot how his shot goes off how his three points looking and all that stuff his dunk driving dunk posterizer everything you guys know that right so i don't know if i'm pretty sure i'm gonna assume highly assume and suggest that that will be a very okay uh, that will be a factor in the game that you guys need to take note of that if you make your dude a height a certain height or a certain weight his speed will get affected his you know dribbling will get affected you guys need to know that for sure but i will make my dude the tallest height as a point guard so he will be able to get blocked somewhat because that is the downfall to my player that i'm making shot creator playmaker that's the downfall is that his block steals and rebounding isn't as high as everything else but everything else is average but him being a shot creator and him being a playmaker at the same time 
his dribbling and passing will be amazing it will be impeccable his shot will be amazing it will be impeccable i know his three-point shot is going to be very good everything else is going to be good but it's just the steals and rebounds and you know blocks isn't going to be the best because his defending or rebounding isn't that good that's not in his name that's not in his title that's not in his skill but it still would be an op badge on offense for sure on the offense, I'm going to be scoring like 60 points a game in my career. Y'all know I'm going to be going to go off in the playground, you feel me? So y'all need to look into these archetypes and these builds that they are showing us on this rare footage right here. If you guys need to pause the video, go ahead and definitely do that to see what you guys are looking for or interested in. Because right now, you guys could check before the prelude even comes out when and where or how you're going to make your archetype with this. This is real leaked footage of the archetypes and the real attributes that they have my dude that they have associated with the skills based on how you choose it so you guys need to take note of this because before the prelude even comes out i think the release date is the 19th i'm not too sure but before the prelude even come out i'm, I'm gonna be look i'm taking notes i'm really taking notes um there's another uh there's another archetype build of two skills that i want to let you guys know if the dual archetype this is going to be a crazy system that we've never seen before but look driving defender my dude a slasher a lockdown slasher look into that oh my god my dude these builds are gonna be crazy so i'm definitely gonna be throwing out some best player builds for you guys when the prelude comes out for sure gotta be ahead of the game i'm not gonna wait until the game officially come out hopefully when the prelude come out we have that you know opportunity to get to that stuff so i will be throwing out best player builds before the game even come out so you guys know what to choose when the real deal my career comes into play so roll to 99 you guys know how this is gonna work out there's no more rep system there's no more it's really not any more legend or all-star pro it's no such thing as that i think we're all gonna be in one single park because that's what the neighborhood is we're all able to run around in one server or not one exact server but we're all able to be in our own servers and whatnot as if it was sunset beach or if we was in different servers and had to join our friends it's like we're all in different servers but we're in a neighborhood where we could run around you guys seen the trailer right we could run around to the tattoo shop swag which is a clothing store we could also make our own shirts we could make our own shirts i'm gonna have a gucci polo finally i'm gonna have a babe shirt my dude a supreme off-white hoodie is this what i'm gonna have man this game it's getting out of hand, man. My fault. It's getting out of hand, dude. So, hey, y'all need to look into this game and look past what we're, you know, what they giving us. This, this stuff is crazy. They're giving us so many opportunities. We can run around a neighborhood to tattoo places, Foot Locker. We can buy shoes inside the park, literally. So, hey, and it's confirmed. I think it's confirmed that we could go to the playground during the prelude. So, hey, we finna be working on our players, man. It's gonna be crazy so yeah like i said pause the video if you guys are interested in any type of archetype builds or combinations that you see like i said man slasher defender that's gonna be a lockdown slasher is gonna be nice what i'm making first i put it on my life dude what i'm making first is the shot creator passing and dribbling he will go off he will his name is gonna be it's, it's insanity is gonna be written all over him i do he's gonna be in the same player and we're also looking forward to making a new crew for 2K18. So definitely, 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 we will get tryouts sooner or later. I don't know. We're we're still thinking of crew names. You know, if you guys need to, you, you guys need to check out Famous K video for that because he honestly came up with crew names and uh, he threw some down. And I don't know how it's going right now, but we're looking for a crew name to make up. And we're gonna start a crew, man. We're gonna be the best crew, you know. But man, I gotta talk about my archetype, dude. Like I said, shot creator passing the dribbling. He will have Hall of Fame ankle breaker. And his primary skill will be a shot creator, dude. Ain't that about a bit? That stuff, cray cray, man. That stuff is crazy. So you guys need to look into the. I'm highly, highly, I'm going to keep repeating it. You guys need to look into these archetypes. I got the video right here so you guys know what y'all may be looking for. Like, look at the combinations. Look at the attributes. Look at the badges that they're going to give you and see what color they are. Or see what, you know, see if they going to be Hall of Fame or gold and whatnot. Y'all need to really be smart about what y'all making because I think, I think, I think there was a rumor and alleged rumor spreading out saying that 
um, if you make another player, if you're going to make a second player, it will set your rep back. But I don't know how true that is going to be because there really is no rep in the game. It's like, I don't know. So you guys just need to be real smart about the players y'all going to make. I'm definitely going to have many accounts where I'm going to make, like I said, the slasher defender as well. Um, I'm going to have to look into a center that I can make, you know, a rebounding dunking center my dude or maybe even a stretch big rebounding center because that's my fault that i had on my faulty uh mistake that i had on 2k17 i had a stretch big right he couldn't get no boards he was seven foot but couldn't get no boards so i might have to make myself a stretch big rebounder my dude because hey my dude could shoot on 2k17 my stretch big could shoot on 2k17 but he couldn't get a board whatsoever so i might have to make myself a rebound and stretch big on some other account it's so many opportunities you can have with the archetype system that they got now and i want you guys to definitely i'm highly highly suggesting that you guys definitely look into the archetypes that they are giving you because hey so many combinations give you so many opportunities and you could get those badges up you could get and many other badges you know they're giving you so many badges that you could get and uh work on so it's gonna be lit man this game is looking lit so far i'm just worried about the only thing i'm worried about right now is the run is the neighborhood really the neighborhood a lot of people are you know assuming that the game isn't going to run efficiently because the neighborhood is going to be like a laggy place man the game always starts off laggy. The game, you know, two, every 2K starts off with some faulty uh, mishap, you feel me, man? They don't they don't start off with anything too smooth or perfect, and I don't expect them to, man. I expect it to break sometimes, but, hey, hopefully the neighborhood is going to be running well because I'm definitely going to be having it. It's definitely going to be a hard-working. I, I was told it was going to be a hard-working road to 99. It's definitely going to be a lot of work you got to put in to basically get to Legend. Legend is like 99, you feel me? Y'all need to understand that first and foremost. So look, it's that guy range, man. I just wanted to talk my ass off about how this game is going to turn out, the archetype systems, man. It's all fully explained right here in this video. So check it out. Again, pause that where you may need to pause that to see what y'all looking into. And that's really about it, man. Range Gang, Gang Gang Kakatu, subscribe, hit that like button, and definitely hit the bell so you get notifications on when I upload. Because 2K18 News will be dropping more efficiently. It'll be running out. You know, many ideas will be coming out, man. A lot of explanations and secrets are going to be revealed and leaked. So look into it by pressing that bell and get notifications, man. Become notification squad. So look, stay guy range. I'm out. Woo woo.